वेलकम टू वैदिक मैथमेटिक्स बेसिस बेस वैल्यूज क्लासेस वी आर इनिशिएटिंग एंड एक्सपोजिंग आवर सेल्व टू फाइव स्पेस वी एम एस टी इन दिस फेज फिफ्टीन वी आर इन द शेल्टर ऑफ द कलाश समिता लॉर्ड स्कंद इज द ओवर लॉर्ड प्रिजाइडिंग डिटी द लॉर्ड ऑफ द कलाश समिता in the present lesson 88 we are focusing upon the shad ang means the formulation kalash is a composition of six letters ka a l a s a this leads to the transcendental code values 1 8 5 2 3 and 1 these values we know is as a composition of three syllables lead to triple pairs 1 and 8 5 and 2 3 and 1 these values 9 7 and 4 or 9 7 3 and 1 this organization feature that if we are in the along the format of a sole syllable then the bindu sarovar is now brahm from here there is a flow of a seven streams it takes to the ardhamatra from there it reaches to tripundram the third which is of three streams and then the central stream flows and reaches up till the fourth quarter we had seen that nine, this organization of 9 taking us to 7 3 and 1 it also taking us to 7 3 and 1 has been a format of a northern hemisphere and a southern hemisphere let us now have a revisit to this divya ganga this transcendental flow let us see that 9 7 3 and 1 values have a jump over value 5 and if this value at the middle if it is jumped then it gives a value 9 7 3 and 1 being a value 20 and if the bridge the gap in between which is bridged by a transcendental value 5 then it takes us to value 5 2 means we are reaching a 5 cross 5 grid we are reaching a square we are reaching a value of a vishnu now it is this reach and vishnu is a six head lord lord skanda is also a six head lord we will be coming after few steps to the distinguishing features therefore this divya ganga pravaha as it is when is bridged at the middle by the transcendental code transcendental value so the transcendental bridge at the middle as such makes a setup of past 5 cross 5 grade of value 25 which is the tcb value of a vishnu and vishnu is the overlord of a six space so here the organization comes to be of shadang of six parts so the kalash divya ganga pravaha the parana vidya soul syllable om vidya the transcendental flow from the artifices of soul syllable om with bindu sarovar as a nav brahm leading to seven streams flow which has a split for three streams in the northern hemisphere and the central stream so we know this reach this feature of the divya ganga prava as such is a setup which provides us a wisdom ancient wisdom how to bridge at the middle the transcendental value so this bridging 
of this bridging is the bridging which requires a proper situation, proper mathematics, proper format, proper values, proper features and these features are the transcendental features and these transcendental features are the transcendental enlightenment. Therefore, when we reach the middle from both ends, as one space giving a reach up to three space and nine space taking to value seven and nine itself is a square of value three, then it makes a discrete flow from both ends, but at the middle there is a need for bridging and this bridging is the sense is the transcendental phenomenon it is this transcendental bridging at the middle which is the value of the enlightenment of the parano vidya of the kalash samita being bestowed by lord skanda lord skanda is a six head lord and six head lord with a seat within the cavity of heart of the transcendental lord shiv so from the cavity of heart of lord shiv lord skanda bestows an enlightenment and this enlightenment which flows from the origin of the transcendental domain from the cavity of the heart of the lord shiv this fulfills at the middle so at the middle there is a transcendental values flow which makes a continuum and this continuum comes to be of value 25 and square now let us make a note in our tcv dictionary that this organization format sequentially when is taken a step ahead that it will give us value 11 and 9 then five to then one will go to three three will go to five likewise nine and eleven however at the middle the bridging here is five cross one if here the bridging is had seven into three if this bridging is had like this then the summation value would be a seven square a step ahead so thirteen and eleven five and seven and bridging by 9 into 5 will give us the value 9 square. One shall have a pause here and take note that the mathematics of 5 space VMST is the mathematics of bridging at the middle of the transcendental flow and this bridging at the transcendental flow is a enlightenment is a transcendental phenomenon and this transcendental phenomenon is the subject matter of enlightenment of the Kalash Samhita and this enlightenment is the enlightenment of Lord Skanda with a seat at the center at the origin of the transcendental domain within the cavity of the heart of Lord Shiv and the transcendental flow from the cavity from the origin is of the sequential values therefore the sadhakas shall sit comfortably and permit the transcending mind to go deep transcend firstly within the cavity of the heart of lord brahma within the one cavity of one's own heart and at the next phase and stage <coughs> one shall further transcend and this further transcendence would amount to a reach from the origin of four space to origin of a five space. It is this reach from origin of four space to origin of five space is the reach of the attainment of the enlightenment of the Kalash Samhita. It, this is the enlightenment of the Lord Skanda. It is this enlightenment which deserves to be imbibed well one shall properly tabulate that the Dive Ganga flow is the flow of nine seven three and one streams and at the middle 
there is a need for bridging and this bridging is had in terms of the transcendental values and these values are supplied by the from the cavity of the heart so when the from the cavity of the heart the transcendental values flow these bridge the gap at the middle and there happens to be a transcendent transcendence from linear order to a spatial order and this spatial order value is a value 25 which is equal to the tcv value of lord vishnu and lord vishnu is the presiding deity of a sixth space a step ahead then Again, we will have a reach at 7 square, 9 square. Therefore, it is this sequential reach. It is this sequential reach which deserves to be appreciated, deserves to be imbibed. So, like it would be a blissful exercise to have a value which takes to the summation value, then, then 3 square, 5 square, 7 square, 9 square and 11 square this reach means is a reach going to be from the linear order reach to a special order reach one space to three space to five space to seven space is a linear dimension to to the domain so if instead of it if we are working we want to attain this reach 1 square to 3 square, 5 square, 7 square, 9 square, 11 square, then we are having a real breakthrough. It is going to be our real attainment. This is going to be the attainment of the order of the enlightenment of the class Samhita bestowed by the Lord Skanda. Now see that the Lord Skanda is providing, is giving, is bestowing the Paranavidya. Now this Paranavidya as it is, if we see, is a, this, if is seen that this format of this letter is that there is going to be a flow In the second letter, it gives us that we are heavy and from here things flow, reaching up till. Then it is a ball, a sphere filled with and it strikes like radiation and ultimately there is a fourth way and it is of the pairing of the balls, spheres. So space is being scanned by the connected spheres. So conduction, convection and radiation are the normal three steps of energy chase, flow and fourth connected particles for swapping the space by the connected pair of spheres is the value is the feature, is the flow, is the format, is the technology, is the mathematics of the Paranav. This Paranavidya of having a chase for the energies in conduction, convection, radiation and a step ahead by the connected ball particles, the pair of energy particles, pair of energy balls being connected amongst them. So it is this feature for which we will focus at the end at the when we will be concluding and when we will be in this Dityavriti, Tritiavriti, Farodavriti that how the Vedic mathematics, the Vedic systems, the Vedic knowledge, the Vedic technologies, the Vedic sciences are handling matter and the energies uh, along a common format. How it can happen, how we can deal with, what would be the mathematics, what would be the steps, what would be the chase systems. We will be learning about them and it is by learning about them we will be going parallel to the Vedic mathematics and its space and technology features. Before that, means in the, we are stopping this feature here, then we are taking up no aspect. Let us revisit the square, a work 
the only geometric dimensional body being availed in a manifest form as a formulation in the Ganita Sutras and Upsutras in the text of Ganita Upsutra 7. And now see, this setup of a square is a setup of four corner points and the four edges and the area unit. These are nine units. So this setup of the square is a setup of nine structural components. A step ahead, ghan, a body, a three space body, a cube, represented a body of hypercube, three as hypercube, three as three space body, is of 27 components. There are eight corner points, there are 12 edges, six surfaces, and one volume. Therefore, this setup of a square and setup of a cube are of 9 and, 20 and 27 structural components and the difference of these structural components, these values, is 80. A step ahead, when we, instead of these bodies, we also frame them in the dimensional frames, then it will add three more components pair of axis and the origin and here four components triple and so it will lead us from 27 to 31 and here it would be reached from 9 to a 12. Therefore the difference between the two will be 90. Let us have a pause here and take note that the difference of the structural components of square and cube leads to value 18 which is the middle value, the synthesis value of a northern hemisphere and a southern hemisphere. And the difference of values of this square and cube within their respective dimensional frames is a 19, which takes us to southern hemisphere. Let us make a proper note in our TCB dictionary and in our the notebook of five space VMST features and values as to how this pair of bodies when are taken up simultaneously, then these lead us to the difference value as 18 and 19 at this pair of phases. A step ahead, if we are having a pair of squares, if we synthesize them, we know the one of this edge will be replaced because it will merge. So the second square will contribute only six components. Likewise, here if we are having a pair of cubes, the second cube will be contributing only eight as the nine structural components of this surface plate, which will get superimposed with the super surface plate of the first cube, the difference would be 18. So we know that the difference value of 9 and 27 had been 18 and the difference of 6 and 18 is going to be 12 and this gives us a total difference value going to be 30. Therefore, let us make a note that when instead of square and a cube, we are having a diamond format for the pair of, squares, pair of squares and a pair of cubes, then these will lead to the difference value 30. The first setup along a monad of one square and one cube is giving us a difference value 18, while the diamond format is giving us a difference value 30. A step ahead, when instead of two squares, we are having three squares, then the third square as well will be contributing value 6, and here the third cube as well will be contributing the value is 12 for the difference value, so we will be having the difference value going to be 42. A step ahead, when we are having a four squares, so quarter squares, synthesizing as a square, the contribution will be 9, 6, 6, and 4 components, and here the quadruple cubes will be giving us a contribution of 17, 18, 18, and a 12. Therefore, the difference of this setup will be of 54. The difference of 3 would be 45. 
let us have a pause and see that the difference value in the first setup is 18 so it is a monad adds one value difference of pair of squares diamond format gives 30 and so the both will add two factors 32 then the trimonad will give a difference value 42 triple squares and triple cubes will give 42 difference three would be addition and it would be fourth so in this quadruple format four quarters as synthesizing a square 50 and it will be 54. if we have an addition of all these it gives to value 140 and here comes to be value 150. now we have a pause here and take note of that the value 40 140 is 14 into 10 while the value 150 is 15 into 10. this takes us to that we know that transcendental domain hypercube file is enveloped within a creative boundary of a 10 components so we know that this square this hypercube 4 is a four space body and it is of 3 4 5 this manifestation layer of summation value 40 further we know that the formulation verga is of tc value 40 here the letter rafe is of value 2 however we know the value rafe also is having complete value as 3 and it will this way this formulation with a complete value for the rafe will take us to 50 these are the features which deserves to be comprehended well and these shall be well documented and these should be properly tabulated it is this proper tabulation of these features will bring us face to face with the phenomenon that the vedic mathematic systems are the systems of the manifested form of the expressions as of a square and a cube and then it also is working out the unmanifest form that be the difference of values the structural values of the square and a cube as in the original state is of a difference values 18 and therefore like that if we proceed we will see that we will be reaching at values 50 and 54 at the end when we are availing a quadruple format or when we are in a creators of space as that when we are approaching the square as a quarter squares which are synthesizing as a square further we know that this difference value 50 and 54 and 50 and 54 means if we are working in the northern hemisphere and we are working in the southern hemisphere then in both hemispheres we will be having the values of 50 and 54 so in both spheres so the complete setup a complete value will giving us a value 100 and 108 means it is coming to be value 208 this is this way we are knowing that the synthesis at the giant of the northern and southern hemisphere as a giant will be a brahman giant will be of value 28 and it gives us a value 236 further we know the middle is of value 47 so it is a value 28 plus 19 therefore it is this feature which deserves to be comprehended well that the transcendental domain is a domain which permits its synthetic organization as of the upper part for the format for the northern hemisphere existence phenomenon and the lower part for the southern hemisphere existence phenomenon so the northern part and the southern parts are synthesized and this synthesis is of value 28 and 28 and 90 these values for northern hemisphere and southern hemisphere as such comes to be 236 and 283 it would be blissful to take note that these values 2, 236 for the northern hemisphere and 283 for the northern hemisphere as such takes us to value 519 which is parallel to the total letters of the text of Ganita Sutras and Upsutras. Therefore, 
the Gita of Sutras is a scripture, a complete in itself of the let 236 letters. Gita Sutras is a complete scripture of 283 letters. Therefore, these 519 letters text of Gita Sutras and Upsutras is the text which is parallel to the format of the synthetic setup of the transcendental domain as a upper part and a lower part. It is this synthetic setup of the transcendental domain which deserves to be comprehended well. One shall sit comfortably and permit the transcending mind to be parallel to this synthetic organization of the transcendental domain. One shall make a note in the technology notebook that the Vedic systems, Vedic knowledge, Vedic mathematics, Vedic science and technology is available. A format of a transcendental domain. Let us have a pause here. Let us revisit transcendental domain. It is a five space content lump as domain fold of hypercube of five, the representative body of a five space. Now this body is a setup, a synthetic setup of a pair of parts. The upper part and the lower part. The upper part is the northern hemisphere. Lower part is the southern hemisphere. The synthetic setup means it is of values range 17, 18 and 19. We know that five space is a transcendental domain which has same setup of values flow at the beginning, at the end as well as at the middle. This value 18 at the middle is the value of hypercube of 5, a fourfold manifestation layer. It brings us face to face with the values firstly as that the pentagon constructs inner pentagon as that none of the diagonals passes through the center and it is an ad infinitum ad infinitum it is because of it that there happens a transcendental cavity at the origin of four space five space plays the role of an origin of four space and at it there happens a transcendental cavity. This transcendental cavity within four space which is of a spatial order deserves to be revisited. It is because of the spatial order that the hypercube 5 setup gets divided into upper part and the lower part as the reflection images of each other of the same values. At the center there is a synthetic setup and it is because of this synthetic setup that the upper part and the lower part, northern hemisphere and southern hemisphere become an integrated self-contained domains as well as both remain synthetically whole as a one. So it is like two as a one and one as a two which is a feature of creators of space for space. It is this feature which deserves to be imbibed well. Further we know that within three space surface is having a pair of faces. This feature that surface is having a pair of features is also a feature which deserves to be 
imbibed well. Between a pair of surfaces, the pulp, the subcontent as such is a volume. It is a three space content. So it is between the pair of surfaces that there happens to be a three space content. It is this three space content in between the pair of surfaces. So each surface with a pair of faces is having a three space content. Now pair of faces as of value 2 will bring us face to face with that the two space with a pair of dimensions of two space create four space with five space as the origin of a solid order. It is this feature and three space is of seven geometries range of seven versions and here because of a split of a three dimensional frame within a four space it becomes a setup of a pair of three dimensional frames of half dimensions with four space as the origin as a synthetic glue. All these features as these are deserve to be imbibed well and that is why here at this seat is a garbhagraha. This garbhagraha is as formulation is of values 15 and 17. Now 15 and 17 are the values which are of the format of dimension and a domain. Therefore in the northern hemisphere the value 17 is again taking us to a format of 15 and 17 which makes 32 and it is of value 2 raised to the power 5 and this is equal to the frequencies of the range 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and 6. Now this way the choices of values from the range 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 to have value 6 or 2 raised to the power 5 frequency. Now it is this which is parallel to the format of a sthapatya mining rod. Further summation value is 21 which is equal to the TCV value of formulation my ur and formulation my ur and my ur is the ativahaka is the vahan of a lord skand. Therefore with these features and values we have to appreciate as to how the setup format of Ganita Sutras and Up Sutras as of 236 letters and 283 letters is parallel to the organization format features of the synthetic setup of the transcendental domain. Therefore, one shall sit comfortably, permit the transcending mind to be face to face with the organization format features of transcendental domain as a synthetic setup of the upper northern hemisphere and lower southern hemisphere and the synthetic joint is constituting a garbhagraha and it is because of it that there happens a transcendence of transcendental order from the transcendental cavity which means 5, 6, 7, 8 and 9 second layer also 5, 6, 7, 8 and 9 and giant value 5 makes it 75 and which accepts an reorganization as 28, 28 plus 19 plus 28 it leads to value 28 and 47 and therefore 208 plus 28 is 236 becomes parallel to the letters of Up Sutras and, and further 47 addition takes to value 283 parallel to the letters of the Ganita Sutras. One shall sit comfortably, permit the transcending mind to thoroughly glimpse 
and imbibe these values and features of the organization format of Ganita Sutras on the one hand and of synthetic setup of the transcendental domain on the other hand and the parallel features of this pair of organization formats on the one hand of Ganita Sutras and on the other hand of transcendental domain brings us face to face with as to how the sadhkas shall approach five space VMST in terms of values of Ganita Sutras mathematics. Thank you very much.